The Political Committee of National Liberation Greek, Politik Epitrope Ethnikis Apolutherosis Politiki Epitropi Ethikis Apolutherosis, PEEA, commonly known as the Mountain Government, Greek, Kybernis II Bono was a Communist Party dominated government established in Greece in 1944 in opposition to both the collaborationist German controlled government at Athens and to the royal government in exile in Cairo. It was integrated with the Greek government in exile in a national unity government at the Lebanon Conference in May 1944. <laughs> <laughs> Background Establishment <laughs> 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 The PEEA was established on 10 March 1944 by the Leftist National Liberation Front Greek People's Liberation Army movement, which was then in control of much of the country. Its aims, according to its founding charter, were, "...to intensify the struggle against the conquerors for full national liberation, for the consolidation of the independence and integrity of our country." and for the annihilation of domestic fascism and armed traitor formations." The PEEA's authority was significantly reinforced after the establishment of the National Council Greek, Ethnico Symbolio in 1944. The National Council was an assembly elected by secret elections organized by the PEEA in late April 1944 in both the liberated parts of Greece and the still-occupied cities, mainly Athens. Between 1.5 and 1.8 million Greeks voted in these elections, which are notable for the fact that for the first time in Greece, women were allowed to vote. The council first converged in Korishades, a mountain village of Evritania, from 14 to 27 May 1944. Its main act was voting a resolution, an extract of which is quoted, the PEEA's first president was Evropedis Bakertsis, the former leader of National and Social Liberation Ica. On April 18 Alexandros Svolos, a prominent professor of constitutional law of the University of Athens, took his position and Bakertsis became vice president. Not only communist leaders but also many progressive bourgeois, who had nothing to do with communist ideas, participated in the PEEA. ELAS not only resisted German and Italian occupation forces but also reorganized life in free Greece, the mountainous areas i.e. the biggest part of Greece it controlled. EAM, with the coordination and organization of the PEEA, helped the local people organize schools, hospitalize refugees from the big cities and protect the crops from German looting. Amateur actors and musicians created traveling theaters and bands, something that most rural communities had never seen or heard before. Another achievement of ELAS due partially to the progressive ideas and partially to the lack of men was to promote women's rights. Young girls, who until then were working at home or the fields, had the opportunity to educate and express themselves. There were also improvised telecommunications either by telephone lines or by messengers and systems of redistribution of food resources, so that no village would starve. <laughs> <laughs> Mountain government Interim government Sources Clogg, Richard A Concise History of Modern Greece Cambridge University Press. ISBN 978-1-1076120-3-7. Papastratus, Procopus 2006. Local Government in Liberated Areas of Occupied Greece. In Bruno de Weaver, Hermann van Gotham and Nico Wouters. Local Government in Occupied Europe 1939-1945. Gent, Academia Press. pp. 205-220. ISBN 9038208928, CS1 maint, Uses Editor's Parameter link. Skaladakis, Yanis From Resistance to Counter-State, The Making of Revolutionary Power in the Liberated Zones of Occupied Greece, 1943–1944." Journal of Modern Greek Studies. 
33 1, 155-184.